dangerous If you're one of us, then roll with us Cause we make the hipsters fall in love When we got our hot pants on and up And yes, of course we does we Hi guys, so I'm going to do a tutorial Need a one inch curling iron That's from Connor And then I have a one and a half inch And it's from Hot Tools When you're out on your own And you need some You're going to need a heat protectant This one's for straight flat iron but it works well and then a clip and a comb for just sectioning off and hairspray that's from L'Oreal so now I'm gonna section off my hair I put the longest layer down and I have a lot of layers so sometimes I can't section off perfectly and that's usually what happens but I usually am pretty good at curling my hair So now I'm going to spray it with heat protectant and I'm going to spray it and as soon as I spray it I need to curl it because that's what's in the directions and it actually works a lot better that way because that's how this heat protectant is designed. But any heat protectant will do and now I'm just taking different sections of my hair and I'm curling it and I like to go through it once and heat it and then curl it and I'm using the bigger curling iron right now and I just kind of switch back and forth between the both curling irons to create more of a messy look but it still looks really pretty. It's a good day to be alive when you're out on your own. Now I'm taking the small one curling iron but anyone works the best. And now I'm gonna continue doing this in a flyer. Here's hoping you'll find it's a good day. It's a good day to be alive. I'm not living without hope. You can't tell me that I'm wrong. Try to teach me how to come back to my senses, cause I won't. So now I finished that layer and I sprayed it with hairspray throughout it. And now I'm taking down. My next layer, or the layer that frames my face, basically, and this is kind of tricky sometimes, so I look a little confused right now. It's a good day to be alive. It's a good day. And this is the last layer that's on the other side of my part. And now I'm just pinning it back up. And for this layer, I'm just going to do smaller curls. So I'm only using the one inch. And basically I'm doing the smaller curls so you can see it go from the bigger curls to the smaller curls throughout my hair when it is done. But right now I'm just finding those longer pieces and curling them bigger curling iron. Here's hoping you'll find it's a good day It's a good day to be alive When it seems impossible And you think that you might be lost When your feet start to run And the shackles come off Look around for the things you need You'll find them inside It's a good Okay, so now I am going to bring all my hair to the front and spray it so they blend more together so I can see how it's turning out so far. And now I'm taking down another section of hair. And I separated it into two, more of the front and more of the back. And I'm going to curl the rest of the back that I didn't get before with big air small curls so I'm putting my top bang part that goes in the front of my hair up to curl the rest of my hair when you're out on your own and you need some time to decide whether you're strong enough whether you should give up a try now I'm taking down my last section which is the front of my hair and pushing the rest of my hair to the back so I can concentrate on this. This I'm gonna do with my 
small curling iron to get the most volume to the front because my graduation cap is sitting partially to the back, but you see it's going on my hair, so you want that to be shown nicely. So now I'm just going to curl this Now I'm going to take the very last piece of my hair that's basically like my bangs except for too long and I'm going to curl it away from my face purposely to make sure that it's not in my eye and I'm going to hold it there for a little bit longer than I usually would hold my curling iron for because I want it to have some more volume up there. So yeah, I just found a piece so I'm going to recurl that too. And then that should be good. And now I'm going to take my hair down and we're going to look at the finished product. When you're out on your own and you need some time to decide whether you're strong enough. Now I'm just going to hairspray my hair one more time and make sure the curls stay in throughout the whole ceremony. And so my hair can stay good for pictures afterwards. It's a good day It's a good day to be alive when it seems impossible. Now you're going to just put on your hat Make sure it's tilted slightly back So you can see the front of your hair and the curls And make sure your tassel's on the right Because move it over to the left after the ceremony is over You'll find them inside now that's about it. So happy graduation to the class of 2012 and just you can do this hairstyle for basically anything. So bye guys.